You know, this is seems a... we got a trespass. Huh? Oh, what the fuck? shit! Uh, no. Five seconds to talk me into defending my property. Uh, this ain't your property. Your property? Five, four. Welcome to my humble abode. I'm Yoko the Tailspin, and this it's tales over coffee. The channel where we start the day together with a cup of coffee and a narrative tale in the hope of welcoming a blessed day. But it's her now to tell me why. Uh, sewing lessons were the absolute worst. She made all our clothes. I'm sure she needed the help. And I, for one, am happy I can fix a torn seam. <laughs> so she was standing here, spying through the window, drawing us while we played. She and Tessa were best friends. Until suddenly they weren't. Yeah. Wonder what happened. Either Tessa got sick of Marianne's moods, or Marianne got sick of Tessa's judgment. Straight in the trash? No. I bet we could sell it on the internet. True. Maybe we could sell it to the guy who collects John Wayne Gacy's clown paintings. Wow. I I can't position for that. Maybe it's not what I'm thinking. Oh. This explains a lot. They're mostly full. She was too stubborn to take medication. She always had to have a picture of us close by. Why this picture, though? I mean, do you see the expression on our faces? I have noticed with one or two Don't Not games, they have a habit of uh, mentally ill equals bad. Yeah. Hmm. I tried to read not this good. one. I can never figure out the order of the chapters, though. Didn't the author go insane or something? No wonder Miriam liked it. It's here. I knew it. I fucking knew it. Do you think she read it? Of course. She was nosy as hell. His diary, where did it build? His gender, I assume. Interesting. Oh, virtual C. Oh. Yeah, don't try and hide it from him. No, okay. Tyler. What? Look. What? Where did you find that? It was on her desk with her papers. Seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, we gotta be really careful not to overthink this. But it doesn't make any sense. She, she was mad, right? She was mad I, I, I cut my hair. She attacked me because I cut my hair. She was mad and she attacked you. We both saw it. Then what is this shit? Interesting. I don't know. I don't know. Tyler, Interesting. Come here. She can't do this to me. Not now. When I've finally made sense of a few things. Things are often more complex than we realize. Well, that was but, your first mistake. Yeah. Thinking the world made any kind of sense. Yeah. <laughs> Ten years in the grave, and she's still finding new ways to piss us off. Yeah. I think I need some air. Is 
See, I would like to know more about that Trust Seekers or Truth Seekers or whatever it was um, book. Because one of those, Raising Your Transgender Child, it sounds from the title, we don't know. Um, like it would be a positive, a transgender positive um, book, trying to advise people who are not used to thinking in those terms about the issues that might go on and so on. So they could be better parents for their transgender child. But while there are some youth ministries, etc., and it's, it looked like a youth ministry type place, that are very positive towards uh, LGBT issues. Also a number that are very condemning. But I'd like to know more about what that was. Are you really, really sure? I am. Do it. Okay. Uh, here we go. <laughs> Whoa. Is it all gone? Yeah. It, it looks amazing. <laughs> really? Yeah. Looks a little wild. Why not? <laughs> I can't wait to show mom. She's been so sad lately. More than sad. She's been scary. Yeah, but not tonight though. It was almost like a party. <gasps> Thank you, Allison. You don't have to thank me. You're my sister. I feel more like, like your brother. Brother, sister, we look out for each other. But I'm pretty sure I just gave you a really bad haircut. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? Oh no. Uh. No, 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 no. This is wrong. This is all wrong. We don't know what medication Wait. she was on, but no. was she on antidepsis? Is she trying to take a life? This is all wrong. Her taking her life? Her being seen doing it? I mean, I don't know that that's what's happening, but that's my first guess. Glad we found your diary. Me too. I guess she was trying to figure out where you were at. Yeah, well, she should have asked. Yeah, she should. It wasn't some goddamn research project. I was her child. She should have asked, but if she cared, she may have gone too far out of caring. Now, that doesn't mean it's right. But... About the 
the book. Raising your transgender child? Do you even know how rare these books were in 2005? Mm. Was she trying to figure out how to support me? Possibly so. Maybe. Which, she wasn't trying. She never... It doesn't make sense, I know. You cutting your hair was what set her off, right? Allison, she read my diary. She already knew. It wasn't my hair. And if we were wrong about that... Fuck. You think she read it. It's possible she never even opened the diary. It's unlikely, exactly but it's possible. She always thought they were. But if she did, and they aren't... God, Tyler. Sure. I mean, we could have been wrong. But what good does it do to ask the question now? You mean other than not having to live with the thought that my mom tried to kill me for being Wow, mean? yeah. Tyler. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty important. I know important. you want there to be something to find. Something that'll make it all make sense. But she was unhinged. So that's it then. She was crazy. Nothing else to say. I think we'd be better off if we tried to move on. Why don't we talk to a... Quick aside, and I'm sorry I do th I, I do this in these games sometimes. I said don't nod. Of, they did it with Nathan, and they've done it all the time as well. I have a habit of playing um, mentally ill equals dangerous or bad. Now, Nathan himself was a patsy. And it wasn't his mental illness, if you look close. This is Life is Strange. That made his behavior what it was. He was led astray by Jefferson and severely abused emotionally by his father. And support, surrounded by yes men at college or at school um, due to his wealth. And bored out from every kind of responsibility he might have had by his father who didn't want to look bad. So even there, yes, they did use that, but it was uh, undermined. Have they undermined this here and led us initially to believe that because she was mentally ill, ta avoiding taking medication, she was a killer? But in fact... She may have been trying to end her own life through depression that was unmedicated. I don't know. These are thoughts that are going on in my mind right now. Do people who knew her see if that book makes any sense to them? People don't want to talk about Marianne. They pretend like that night never happened. What about Tessa? She was Marianne's closest friend. Let's ask her about it. Sure. But I'll warn you, she's particularly touchy about this subject. Wow, this could also tie in. Me. I was always her favorite. Operative word was. This could tie if Tessa. To the store anyway, to get a few things for the repairs. Great. Two seagulls, one stale hunk of bread. I'm not sure I like that analogy. Listen, I know you don't want to keep talking about this. But you're obviously not going to be satisfied until we do. So let's talk. If Tessa was judgmental, which was said, she may have been judging Alex. Uh, sorry, um, Tyler, Alex. Um, and um, that may be why they, they stopped talking to each other. I don't know. These are all thoughts that might be or might not be. Right, is something wrong? You've been on edge all day. Is there something more going on with you? It's nothing. Pretty sure it's not nothing. And I'd like us to be on the same page. I thought we were on the same page. Sell this place as quick as possible and move on. What's happened to you here? What's happened to you here, Alison? Look, I've already explained why this is so important to me. Why are you still dragging your feet? It's just with the way you avoided this place for the last three years. No, it's years, not. You're lying. You wouldn't want to spend any extra time here. Oh. No, it's not because he said he is, and you're still yeah, dragging your feet. This is about. Maybe a little, yeah. It's just you graduated three years ago, and this oh, is the maybe. first time we've seen each other in person. Wasn't ready. It's not that I didn't want to see you. I just wasn't ready to be Tyler in Delos Crossing. I tried to visit you. I tried to go to your That's fire graduation. Hurt. I wanted to bake you a crappy boxed cake and take awkwardly posed photos. I know. But you shut me out. Yeah. All I got was non-responses and half-assed evasions. 
don't don't say stop making it about you because it is about both of you, and it, a relationship is always about the two people. Look, I didn't want to see anyone. I just started testosterone, <coughs> and oh god, I had the worst acne. My emotions were all over the place, and the smells. Allison, the smells. Men smell bad. I know. We do. I've dated a few. Look, I needed some time to figure my shit out before I asked anyone else to try. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, it does. So, I was thinking... Hmm? Do we need to be in such a rush to sell this place? We've been over this, and we both agreed it's time for a clean break. I know. Trust me. I'm not talking about staying for long. Just long enough to get some answers. And you think this house has those answers? Maybe not, but it's a place to start. Well, it would be a shame if there was something to find and we tossed it out. How about we start digging without putting off the sale? And if it seems like we need more time, we'll talk about it then. Okay. That's fair. So, we have a plan? Yep. We ask around about Marianne, but we also stick to our repair schedule. If that's really what you need. All right. Deal. Always diary. It's been a long time since I heard that name. Was I the only one who ever called you that? Actually, no. I used it at Fireweed for a while, until I settled on Tyler. Most people were pretty chill about the switch. Not everyone, though. What do you mean? I had a mentee who refused to call me Tyler. <laughs> he didn't want my help. He didn't want anyone's help. I'm sorry. I like the name Tyler, by the way. Thanks. Mom and Alice and argued again. At least I'm not the only one Mommy's screaming at now. I Mom almost seemed jealous we didn't tell her what we were planning to do in the forest. Alice thinks we should tell her about our voice. I know she think uh, I know, but I think she knows already. Mom seemed really upset when I asked to join the hockey team. Mom hear their voices? Did she know already? I don't know. Um, when I asked to join the hockey team, like it's wrong for me to play a boy spot. I'm gonna keep asking, and we'll try again next week. Okay, said no again. I'm so mad at her. Why does she always say no? Why doesn't she ever let me do what I want to do? Alice and I started writing a story. Well, Alison did. She didn't like it when I tried to change anything. Why can't one of the goblins be a boy goblin? Saw so Star Wars yesterday at Bobby's place. Luke was so great, but Mum found out we watched it and got mad. She said it gloried, it gloried war. Ziom, ziom. Oh. Saturday 5th February 2005. Mum would be happier if I could do what she wanted me to. When she looks at me, she just doesn't see me. I wish I could show her. I wish I could make her understand. I think she doesn't want to. Alison told me again that it was my fault Mum got angry at us. She is such a suck up. Mum's barely said anything uh, in a few days. Ali said she saw her throwing away pages from the Book of Goblins. Do this, do that. I, uh, I am sick of her voice. I'm sick of that dumb na name too. I'm Ollie the Goblin. Okay. Not a bad view, right? I forgot how beautiful it is. Remember that time we tried to cross the lake after it froze over? Oh yeah, how can I forget? Marianne lectured us for an hour. Well, she wasn't wrong at least. It was really dangerous. If we'd fallen in, no more goblins. We grew up on this lake. We know how to spot thin ice. I think we should head out right away. Already tired of the view? 
just finding it hard to relax and enjoy it with so much on my mind. Go ahead. I'll catch up. Need to respond to a message. Uh -huh. I think something's nice going on for her. Social butterfly. You know, this is seems a... we got a trespass. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? shit! Uh, no. Five seconds to talk me into defending my property. Uh, this ain't your property. Your property? Five, four. I'm Tyler. Don't know any Tylers. Three, two. Sam. Ellie, what are you doing out here, girl? This is our house. Was I talking to you? Sam, put the gun down. This is Tyler, my brother. Well, your brother? <laughs> oh, shit. Huh. I guess I heard about all that, but I never. Wrong copy's ass. Sam, you look like a real Oh, man. shit. That's not a good thing to so say. So do you, Sam. <laughs> you know what I mean. Yeah, we know what you mean. Didn't know they could make a woman looks so much like a man he's not a woman not a woman who looks like a man Sam a man a real man just like you oh shit that's what just when he's not what something you're again. thinking about you gotta excuse us old guys I really don't but Come on. You can't if he's trying, you could try. Rules. You can't expect us to keep If he carries on being an asshole, you don't. People are who they say yeah. they are. It's not hard. No, That's fair. It ain't hard, but it just takes some getting used to. We'll get used to it, because we aren't going anywhere. So, what are you doing here exactly? All right, she backs oh, him down. Yeah. I, I understand this belligerence. I'm kind of keeping an eye on this place for you, you know? Like patching the roof, checking the pipes, and all that stuff. Thank you, Sam. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, that's no big deal. I just, you know, your mama, she was, uh, she was a special lady. She deserved much better than, you know, uh, what you got. Didn't you used to help Mary Ann with repairs and building projects? Oh, yeah. Yeah, seeing as your mama never had a man around, I just you know, took it on myself to help her keep this place standing. How antiquated of you. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, yeah, guess you two are still aiming to sell the place? That's the plan. Which, by the way, we need your keys. Since apparently you went and changed the locks? Oh yeah, absolutely. But, uh, selling your mother's house? Are you sure? Bad or good? It's all you've got left of her. Yeah, but sometimes people want to move on. Not all. I'm sure the gun she tried to kill us with is still somewhere in there. Tyler! What? I wasn't with quite Tyler planning to go that ballistic. A fresh start is what we both need. Of course. Uh, this place has got to be full of all kinds of bad memories. But maybe some good ones, too? My completely off the wall question, and I don't think I got to it before he interrupted with a gun, is does she have issues with transgenderism? If she wouldn't let one of the goblins be male, and I don't know. I mean,. Probably not. That's off the wall. It doesn't really make sense, but... Hmm. Allie, can you hear me? Ty, we can't do this when we're in the middle of talking to someone. But this is pointless. He's hammered. He's always hammered. <laughs> and who knows? Maybe it'll make him chatty. Now come on. People think our family is weird enough. Um, everything okay with you two? Yes. No. <laughs> oh, all right. <laughs> we should get going. 
that's all you think we'll get out of him? Yeah, let's... Let's pursue. I guess I could ask him a few more questions. Okay. How well did you know her? Not as well as I thought. When I heard what happened that night, well... I figured people were bullshitting me. It really surprised you, didn't it? Much as anything ever has. Other folks say they saw it coming. <sighs> Not me. Did you help with her door? Her door? The puzzle on her bedroom door. Oh. Oh, yeah. yeah. You two kept sneaking in, giving her no privacy, huh? You ever solve it? Yep. Better late than never, I guess. <laughs> uh, never solved it myself. Uh, I mean, not that I wanted to. I, well, not hard if you read the right story. Uh, so, uh... Guess you know all your mama's secrets now, huh? Well, she may have one or two left. I think that's all we've got. We should get going. That's all you think we'll get out of him? Well, there's no other questions to ask. He's too wasted to be of any more help. I'll tell him to get a move on then. Well, we've got a supply run to make, and Uncle Eddie's expecting a visit, so. Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Uh, get going, you two. Um, Sam, we all got to get going. Oh, uh, of course. Of course, yeah, I got lots to do myself. I... Lots of to-dos on old Sam's list. And you don't want to keep Brown waiting, you know? <laughs> Thanks for looking out for this place. Happy to do it. I... Uh, don't hesitate to reach out if you need anything. Anything at all. You hear? Sam? Huh? Uh, Sam? Huh? The keys? Oh, yeah. Of course. Of course. Yeah, they're, they're yours. I, uh... uh mm, this place... It meant a lot to your mother. It almost felt like... It was a part of her, and... and it's like some part of her is alive here still. Mm-hmm. Hopefully the house doesn't turn out to be a murderous psycho that tries to oh, kill us in our sleep. Oh, God. Huh? I uh, uh, yeah. Well, uh, I understand doing take that. Take care but... of yourself, uh, both of you. I can understand that reaction. Okay, so we really Just do have a lot didn't need something. Okay, go on. I'll be right behind you. Well, he's a young guy, and even I fuck up that way sometimes at fifty-five. Some things don't need saying. Some things do. All right. Looks like that's it for now. So join us for the next episode. And uh, in the meantime, enjoy your coffee. I hope you have a blessed day. And if you want to help the channel grow, hit the like, comment, and subscribe. Very well.